Hello everybody, this is Hammer Striker here. I've got the latest core belt from Core Belts. I've worn these belts for years. In the early days I looked through all sorts of different kind of gun belts that all either fell apart or cracked or were uncomfortable. It's like wearing a steel band around your waist. When I ended up getting the first core belt, I stopped looking. So when they hit us up just recently and said they had a new belt out and wanted to know if we wanted to review it, the answer was definitely yes. These belts hold up well, they're comfortable, they don't sag when you put a gun on them or a holster on them. They don't twist and bend, but it also doesn't feel like you got a steel belt. They're very comfortable and flexible, but they don't sag. And if somebody were to look at one, whether it's this one here or one of the dress ones that they've got, it doesn't scream gun guy. So unlike some of the gun belts that have all sorts of characteristics that kind of stand out as different, they look just like a regular belt. So this one has turned out to be as nice as the other ones, so I'm happy to be able to show it to you guys. First thing I'll do, uh, this little plastic thing, these are $4, $3.95, and you can put three belts on them and hang them. So it allows you to store your belts. So they set this along, and there's your website, coreessentials.com. And there is a discount code, HAMMERSTRIKER10, and it's also on our affiliate page. That'll get you a 10% discount on any of these things you're looking at. Kind of the key thing to these core belts, in addition to the comfort, the durability, and everything, is how easy they are to set up. Basically, five bullet points on the instructions. That's all it takes to do it. And unlike a lot of the gun belts that I looked at, where you have to go through all these weird measurements to try to figure out what size to order and hope you get it right, the belt just comes in a size. It comes the up to 44 inch waist, up to a 40 inch waist, I'm sorry. You add four inches to your waist size if you want to be able to have the belt loop nicely. This one's kind of overdone because I had it done for just the video. Uh, and you add six inches if you're going to carry a thick inside the waistband. But it's really easy to do. And I'll show you the buckle. First I'll show you the mechanism that works it. Push this little button and they slide. And it slides in quarter inch in increments and locks. So if you want to tighten it, you just give it a little pull, but it won't loosen. Push this little button and it loosens. But effectively the belt, the, the buckle, this will be open, you back these two screws out, slide the belt in, flip this over, lock it, tighten the two screws down, and you're done. Real easy to set up. Now this particular one is their new Western belt, and it's a buffalo leather, so it's not shiny and polished like your typical dress belt. It's kind of more of a matte finish, and they have it in black and brown. And, of course, keeping in mind with that Western theme, this is the cowboy belt buckle. They've also got a star, a bull with the horns, a guitar, a rodeo style that's actually kind of looks more like a conventional belt buckle, but it still uses that locking mechanism that you see here, and a flag. So there's a couple choices in this Western line. These are inch and a half belts, so they'll fit in most pants. They'll work with most holsters. They're really durable. You can hold about a six pound load on these belts. And you notice they do flex nicely to be comfortable. But what they won't do is twist and sag and bend over like a typical fashion belt. So they're flexible where they need to be so they're comfortable to wear and they move with your body. But they're rigid where they need to be to keep a holster, keep a gun upright, keep your phone and everything else you want to hang on it. And I've actually bought far more of these things than they've sent us. Different colors, different styles, different buckles. They're really high quality and I really like them. One of the things I'm showing you right here is the belt protector. This is a sleeve that's optional, they're $3.95, and this sleeve you can put anywhere on the belt or not at all. And if you've got a holster that's going to rub or particularly aggressive, you can use this to protect the belt from it. But I've found that these, their belts in general hold up real well to the holsters and things that I put on them. Generally it takes me a couple years to destroy one of these with daily use and not taking any care to care for it, just putting it on me, hanging my holster and my phone, and off I go. So they do hold up very, very well overall. And they do have a one-year warranty, so if something does fail. But all of the other various gun belts that I tried, they didn't last anywhere near two years. Generally three to six months. They'd start cracking, they'd start splitting, they'd start peeling. The laminate would come off them. These, these don't do that. So I really can't speak highly enough about these core belts, and I do use them every single day. Of course, I got it upside down. Uh, I do use them every single day. 
and I really do like them. Now I noticed when I was doing the research for this, when they sent us this, that their line has expanded a lot since last time I looked. They've got wallets now. They've got tactical belts that you might use for competition or hunting. So if you have any interest in their wallets, their tactical belts, things like that, let us know because I'm sure I can either buy one or they'll send us one and we can do a review on it. But I kind of focused on CCW. It seems like the majority of our channel viewers are focused in the CCW arena. So from an MSRP perspective, you can buy just the buckle for $29.99, just the leather for $39.99, or you can buy it as a set for $69.95. And that's a lot cheaper than a lot of the gun belts that I paid high dollar for that didn't hold up anywhere near as well. Beyond that, if you like our channel, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe, click that bell to be notified if you do. Check us out on Facebook, Patreon, Instagram, Twitter, Getter, we're kind of everywhere. Don't forget Hammer Striker 10 if you decide to buy one of these. And thanks again, Core, for sending us this belt to review.